welcome! In today's video, I will be explaining the magic wand in Ibis Paint X, which is one of the features on the toolbar. The magic wand can be found on the left panel on tablets and under this button on cellular devices. The magic wand is very helpful for coloring in your drawings without going out of the lines or being sloppy with it. For that reason, it can also save time because you won't be trying to carefully avoid messing up. This tool is like the bucket tool, just a little more advanced, yet still very easy to use. If you have any enclosed area that you want to color in, just tap on it. You can select several sections at the same time. You'll know it has worked when dotted lines appear around the shape, informing you that the area has been lassoed. Now, when you color in the object, it will only color in the lassoed area. You can also do all your shading and editing all at once. Once you are done, go back to the magic wand and select remove selection in the bottom right corner. You'll notice that besides the add function, there is a subtract and set. This is because we can add several shapes at once. In fact, you can add as many as you want. If you select subtract and then select a shape, it will remove the lasso from that shape. If you select set and add a shape, it will lasso that shape and remove all other lassos. Now that you know how to use this function, you might be asking, Sour Sugar, how is this any different from using the bucket tool in the selection layer? To that answer, girl, I have no clue. That's a really good question. The lasso tool, selection layer, and magic wand all have very, very similar functions. It's really up to you to decide which one you like best. And with that, we have completed my tutorial on the magic wand function. For explanations of all the features on the Ibis Paint X toolbar, check out my playlist. Please let me know if you have any questions about this feature or any other features at all. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day.